Hi guys and welcome back to Danny Media TV. This is part two and I am now in the Black Mesa research facility. So let's continue. Hey creepy scientist dude, have a wet floor sign. At least try to maintain decorum, Freeman, please. Sorry. It's G-Man. G-Man is here. I can't hear what they're saying. Okay. You guys look like you're really working on some technical stuff. You don't realize your lives are going to be in danger soon. I kind of feel sorry for you. Oh boy. I suppose I better say goodbye to my good friend Morgan Freeman. Where is he? Is anyone else getting uh, hungry? Nothing like the morning of a big Hi, test. Hi, Morgan. Uh, I can't remember the last time I've seen the lab above. See ya. <laughs> Indeed. That's all I could Quite say. invigorating. Uh, uh -huh. Good luck. Best of luck. Try not to get probed by aliens. Here we go. Now, what's this door? Oh, oh would you look at that? Freeman actually did show <laughs> up for work this morning. What, you... Looks like somebody here owes me lunch. Well, good morning, Freeman. Uh, yeah, yeah, good morning. You guys doing bets on whether I've been here for work? Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. There's a pepperoni pizza in my near future. Yeah. I'll be a joke on it. <laughs> I'll be a joke on it, he says. They're placing bets on whether I turn up for work. That experiment is single-handedly responsible for inspiring... Hmm. Don't know what they're talking about. Morning, champ. Hey, what's up? Hello. Hi. What are you guys cooking? Let me heat that up for you a little bit. Didn't turn it on. What's wrong with you guys? Come on. Oh, boy. Good um, heavens! What the hell? Um, whoops. My bad. Uh, yeah. You think you can fix the vending machine too, college boy? We will never hear the end of this. I... Yeah, you best make like an atom and split. Uh, I can give it a try, though. Alright, I'm gonna take this soda. It might protect me in battle. I'm not smug, I'm just better than you. I'm not smug, I'm just better than you. Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous <laughs> ties? Because they make you look like scientists, do. I don't think the creators were thinking, hmm, let's give these guys t-shirts and uh, rat shorts, or maybe no robes. Paper. No? You need toilet paper? Here, have a can. Here. Uh, hello? Hello? Could somebody get me some toilet paper? Yeah, sure. Um, Excuse me. Minor emergency. Is it? Uh, I'm sorry, I, I can't seem to find any. <laughs> He's gonna be in there for the rest Don't of his life. Don't panic, Harold. Don't panic. He's gonna be in there for the rest of his life. I actually got a can of drink so you can survive for, I don't know, another day. And it's my superhero armor. <laughs> or some like to call it a hazardous suit. Come to daddy. Black and orange, black and orange, black and orange, black and orange. Yes. It's my locker. And I'm gonna take that. Yeah. Jumping for joy, baby. And I can now run. Check me out. Come on, guys. Bob your head along to this. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's the lift. Uh, every elevator should have a bin in it. That's my philosophy. In case somebody gets lift sick. Or something like that. Plus it can be quite a, a good friend if you're forever alone or there's aliens everywhere 
That's normally quite a bad thing too, I suppose. Oh, look at this place! Excellent. Right. What's up, Doc? Hey, what's up, Bugs Bunny? You guys aren't drinking your drinks? Are you crazy? Hmm. Ah, Freeman. Yep, that is my name. Ah, Gordon. Look at there you. you are. Nice of you to finally join us, Doctor. We've just Faces sent a sample to the test chamber. You've been using that moisturizer? The anti -mass spectrometer to it's my twin brother, Gamble, Sword and Freeman. Resolution. The administrator is very concerned that we get a conclusive Sword analysis of today's sample. I gather he went to some lengths to get it. Mm. They're waiting for you, Gordon. Of course. Test chamber. Right. That is a Come really cool there. mug. You Do you mind if I have that? Uh, excuse me, Sorden. All right. Eli has been busy making last-minute preparations for the new experiment. Okay. Greetings, Eli. Hey, Eli. I trust this What's up? Finds you well. Gordon. Good morning. Mine's you too. I'm glad you're here. These last minute changes, they're, they're a bit strange to just... Oh! It's um, about to go critical. What are you guys running this stuff on? What in the blazes is going on oh. with our equipment? Oh. It was hmm. never meant to do this in the first place. Oh. <laughs> I'm just standing here with a Half-Life mug. <laughs> Run along, Gordon. We'll be but a moment. All right, uh, sure thing. Sorry, uh, Mug, I can't have you. I'll chuck you down there, actually. Right. Every lift must have a bin. No! What's happening to that bin? Okay. By Beckrell's ghost! The radiation level is off the charts. You mastered the teleportation jitsu, Sordon. Hey, what's up? Oh, there you are. Everybody's been looking for you, hombre. Hey, oh, hey guys. Is. You have no idea what you're about I'm to do, by the way. Deviating a bit from standard analysis procedure today, Gordon. Um, yes, yes, but with good reason. Right, I have to stop you. You're gonna kill us all otherwise. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. I have to leave them there. You guys don't know what you're doing. No, no. As long as we follow standard insertion you know, procedures. We could survive a lot more years if you guys don't do this. Don't you Apart from you, that. you've probably got a couple Although more years left in, you know. The you know. No offense. Is extremely unlikely. I just don't Gordon doesn't need to hear all this. Yeah. He's a highly trained professional. Yeah, I am. We and I like coffee. That nothing will go wrong. Yes. You're right. Gordon, we have complete confidence in you. You better. Well, go ahead. Let's let them in now. You guys, don't do this. <laughs> you can't do it, can you? No! No, you guys have no idea what you're doing. Oh, boy. All right. This is where things go crazy, guys. Testing. Testing. I can hear you loud and clear. Everything seems to be in order. All right. Oh boy. All right, Gordon. Your suit should keep you comfortable through all this. The specimen will be delivered to you in a few moments. Cool. Now, if you would be so good as to climb up and start the rotors, I'm up here. We can bring the anti-mass spectrometer to 80 percent and hold it there until the carrier arrives. Oh man. Alright. Let's welcome Chaos. You guys have no idea what you've just done by the way. This place is gonna go up like a firework display. Very good. We'll take it from here. You sure that's a good idea? I thought I was the professional here. I might be able to stop it with this stool. 
This stool might be able to stop you. Stage two, it did nothing. Uh, I can't stop this from taking place, obviously. I like your empath empathis. I can't say that word. Um, I like your repetition of the word. Probably. We've just been informed that the sample is ready. It should be coming up to you with anyone. Emphasis? I think that's it. Oh boy, here we go. Here we go! Standard You see, I told you this was a bad idea. You should probably get me out of here now, after doing all of this for you. Look at it. Look at the state of this. Okay, you guys are going to save me. I get that. Looks like I'm going to have to shut this thing off. Uh. Shut it off. I can't shut it off. The thing is broken. Oh, boy. Uh-oh. Teleported me back down the ladder. No. Uh oh. I'm in the alien world now. Um. Hey guys. You want to buy some drugs? I'm a scientist. Don't do drugs, by the way. Especially if you're an alien. Unforeseen consequences. Well, I saw these consequences happening. Ah, uh, all right. Open this thing up. Hurry! All right. No! Security guard! Why are you looking at me? He's looking at me. He's looking at me like, why did this happen, man? I've got to get out of it. Whoa, okay. Um, flashlight. Oh my god, is Morgan alright? Morgan! Oh no. Hey guys. Listen, I, I tried the one. I never thought I'd see a resonance cascade, let alone create one. By Schrodinger's cat, he's alive. Gordon! I am alive. Thank god for that hazard suit. Yeah. All the phones are out. I can't reach anyone. If I wasn't black and orange, something terrible might not have happened to me. And let someone know that we're stranded down here. There's no telling what kind of danger is. Um. Okay, we've got a head crab over here. See, this is what happens when you have sex with aliens. You get head crabs. Can't afford to waste time. Believe me, for the retinal scan. I'm certain the rest of the science team will help you along. With God's sake, keep that suit on until you end the clear. You hear me? <sighs> Fine. I don't want to take it off anyway. It looks really cool. Oh, uh, you should probably get away from that door. Um, bad beams, etc. These beams look like they could kill you. I'd get away from that door if I was you. Or explode. That's fine too. Ah, uh, time to go! Uh, oh my god, that was close. And it's my first encounter with an alien monster man. Right. Uh, oh boy. Uh, I'm being attacked by crabs. <laughs> um, jump! You've got to crouch jump. It's the only way you can survive is crouch jump. Right. Uh oh, the lasers are going haywire. Um, I tell you what, those things are probably going to be able to kill me, actually, aren't they? So, 
I am going to save it here very quickly. And this is where I'm going to leave part two. <laughs> Things are going pretty nuts right about now. So join me in part three so I can see whether Morgan is still alive. See you next time.